A noun is a word that names a person, animal, place, thing, or idea. There are singular nouns. Singular nouns are words that name one thing. There is one giraffe eating. The word giraffe is a singular noun. Now, there are seven giraffes walking through the grasslands. The word giraffes means more than one giraffe. The word giraffes is a plural noun. By adding the letter S to many nouns, you can make them plural. There is one parrot sitting on a limb. Now, there are two parrots sitting on a limb. The boy is eating an apple. The man is picking apples. The balloon floated into the sky. The balloons floated into the sky. Adding S to the end of many nouns makes them plural. However, there are times that you need to add ES to make a noun plural. For example, the plural of sandwich is sandwiches. The plural of box is boxes. The plural of walrus is walruses. The plural of buzz is buzzes. The plural of bush is bushes. The plural of bus is buses. If the word ends in S, X, Z, CH, or SH, the plural is usually formed by adding ES. Many words end with the letter F. Like the word shelf. To make shelf plural, change the F to V and add ES. The plural of shelf is shelves. There is one leaf and there are many leaves. The plural of calf is calves. These moose calves are eating plants. Some words that end in F-E, like the word knife, follow the same rule as words that end with F. The cook uses a knife in the kitchen. To make it plural, change the F-E to V-E and add an S. The cook uses many knives in the kitchen. However, not all singular nouns that end with the letter F follow that rule. For example, the plural of the word roof is roofs. The roofs are covered with snow. Many words end with the letter O. To make some of them plural, you need to add ES. The plural of tomato is tomatoes. The tomatoes grow on the vine. The word buffalo ends with the letter O. To make the word buffalo plural, you need to add ES. The buffaloes grazed on the grass. Some words, like piano, end in O, but to make them plural, you only need to add an S. The music shop had many pianos for sale. Now let's talk about rules to make words that end with the letter Y plural. If the word ends in a vowel, A-E-I-O-U, plus the letter Y, like the word toy, all you need to do is add an S to make it plural. The girl played with her toys. The word key ends in a vowel plus the letter Y. To make 
he, plural, simply add an S. He had many keys on his keychain. If the singular noun ends with a consonant plus the letter Y, like the word butterfly, change the Y to IE and add an S to make it plural. The butterflies got nectar from the flower. The word lily ends with the consonant L and the letter Y. To make the word lily plural, change the Y to IE and then add an S. The lilies moved gently in the wind. Candy ends with the consonant D and a Y. Using the rule, we change the Y to IE and add an S. There are many candies to choose from. Sometimes words don't follow the rules. Those words are called irregular plural nouns. Some words don't change when you make them plural, like the word fish. One fish swims at the bottom of the sea. Many fish swim at the bottom of the sea. The plural of deer is deer. No S is needed. The deer looked for food in the snow. Some irregular nouns change in different ways when you make them plural. For example, the word foot becomes feet. The singular noun child changes to the plural noun children. The child played on his smartphone. The children played on their tablets. Mouse is a singular noun, and the plural noun is mice. There are lots of rules to know about plural nouns. But learning about plural nouns helps you to communicate better with other people. Whether you're writing an essay, reading a book, or just having a conversation, it's the proper use of grammar that helps people to better understand each other. <laughs> like us. Subscribe. Ring the bell. Comment, Comment below. below.